usually learn some of my best lessons from God through the weather, most specifically through storms. I was driving to Orlando to see Covered by God with Tiffany, with Tiffany Montgomery a couple weeks ago. I don't like driving in the rain, but I'm used to it because I've lived in Florida for 10 years now. The rain usually doesn't bother me, but sometimes there's really big downpours and I don't care how used to these storms that I, I am, I still don't like to drive through them. And I checked the weather the night before, I checked it the whole day of, and the weather said there were gonna be clear skies. Well, as I'm halfway there, I see drops of rain start falling on my windshield. And I look up and it's just pitch black. Now, while I'm driving, because I don't get a lot of alone time, that's usually my time that I will just really talk to God and take advantage of that time alone with him. And I was just cruising along. I was just so relaxed, so comfortable, just driving. I was at peace. And then I saw the rain and I saw the clouds and I immediately started to first, I got annoyed because I checked the weather app and there was no signs of rain, right? Not a cloud in the sky all day until I get on the road. And I stopped praying and began to, again, get annoyed. But then I also kept focusing on the clouds and the rain. And all of a sudden I realized, wait a minute, why am I more focused on these clouds and this storm than I am what I was already doing, which was praying and talking to God and playing my worship music? Why was I more focused on what I saw outside of the car that really didn't have anything to do with me? So I went back to what I was doing. I went back to talking to God. I went back to praying. I went back to singing. And I don't know how much time passed. But before I knew it, I realized I hadn't even noticed that I wasn't under that big black cloud anymore. It was clear blue skies and white fluffy clouds. And there was no storm. And I realized I had taken my attention and I put it on God. And I focused on what was going on within the car and my conversation with God and how I was feeling. And it took away the annoyance that I felt. It took away any anxiety that I may have had having to drive through a storm. And I put all that attention, focused it on God, and I wasn't worried anymore. I was back full of joy and excited to get to where I was going. The scripture that I, that I thought of is Psalms 16 and 8. I keep my eyes always on the Lord. With him at my right hand, I will not be shaken. I just wanted to give this quick message because so many things come at us that we don't expect. Just like I wasn't expecting that storm. Even though I did what I was supposed to do, I checked the weather, but the storm still came. So there are times in life where we, we think we're prepared. We think that we looked up ahead, but we didn't know what was coming. My best advice to you is to take your eyes off of the storm and your current circumstances and keep your eyes on God. And before you know it, you'll be out of the storm. Actually, while you're still in the storm under that cloud, as long as you focus on God, you'll begin to feel peace that surpasses all understanding. And you won't even notice the chaos and calamity going on around you because you'll be so focused on God. So remember, no matter what's going on, keep your eyes on God. He's got you. Just trust him.